morning, we have a weather question coming from Gibbs High School, our 10 News School of the Week, powered by Duke Energy Florida. Hi, my name is Noah Diggs, and I am a student ambassador at Gibbs High School. And my weather question is, what is an anvil cloud? Hmm, you guys have probably seen an anvil cloud and you didn't even realize it. This is an anvil cloud right here, and they can be pretty ominous when you see them off on the horizon. Let's talk about how it forms first, and we'll explain why it's called an anvil cloud. So in thunderstorms, which an anvil cloud is, it's just a very mature thunderstorm. You have updrafts, you have air flowing high, then you have downdrafts coming in the storm. So updrafts and downdrafts, but you also have very high up in the atmosphere this, this level called an equilibrium level, where the air stops rising. The air is no longer able to rise, so these updrafts, they hit this almost like a ceiling, so the air in the updrafts are forced outward. So forced back and then forced forward, forced horizontally. And that's why you start to get that sort of expanding part of the upper level of the cloud. So you have that shape. But again, why is it called an anvil cloud? You know, metalworking? Yes, it looks an like anvil. one. Doesn't it look just like an anvil? It's about to fall down on the road runner. <laughs> <Let's> <laughs> that's what right. I see. Let's hope not, though.